That's pretty outfit. Hello, my dear friends. I know I'm not prepared to do fencing here, but I would like to take at least two one lesson so I can um, lose some weight and uh, get ready just in case my friends step away from me. Is that okay with you? Are you happy to help? All right. How should I sneak in here? Come on in. Do you have a door? All right. Eye technology. It's very malleable. And Look at this, my armor. So we provide lessons in long story, as these folks here are using. We also provide lessons in the rapier. Uh, I am thinking that at the moment, uh, the long sword field is fairly full, but we may be able to sneak around them and do a lesson in rapier off to the side. All right. So I'm going to have one here, I'm going to find another, and I'm going to Okay, I don't even know how to hold this thing. <laughs> okay, how to hold this? <laughs> okay, hello, are you seeing this? You know it's hard to grab. Check this out. Oh, I guess I may be grabbing like that. So, this is a rapier. This is a thrusting weapon. It is. It has a sharp point, which we cover with a blunt so that we All right. don't damage people. Okay. It has a complex guard. So, are you right-handed? Right-handed, yes. Very good. So, put your hand in. How? There. Like yeah. that? Uh, mm -hmm. Like that? No. So grab. Sorry, you're rotated. Yeah. Wrap your index finger around here. Index. Yes, very good. And your thumb rests over here. That's okay. it. All right, I finally knew how to grab so, this thing. Woo! <laughs> it's heavy. It's, it is a bit heavy, and, and we hold them out away from our body. So this is going to be good for your uh, for your muscle tone. So you hold it extended out. Tuck your elbow in. Elbow. Your elbow. Yeah, that's it. Don't let your elbow fly out to the side. Okay. Good. And the other thing is we hold our upper body back because the important stuff, our, our brain, face. our Face. Yeah, torso. my beautiful we, we, face and you, smart mind. You want to keep that as far from heart. the point Lovely as possible. Heart. Correct. Okay. The weapon, then, tell me. So, you can keep reasonably close. So, when you uh, want to perform an attack, you extend the arm, Extend out. Okay. No, don't move your feet. Just leave your feet in place. Bring your balance back to center so that you're balanced. And then you're going to take one step with your front foot only. If you can. Right or left? Your front foot. Whichever is in front. That'd be yes. And then rotate that. Okay. One more time. That's it. So you're going to hit and rotate, which is what protects you from the other person's weapon. Now, if my weapon is over on this side, when you hit, you're going to rotate it that way. Okay. So you keep the knuckle bow, that's this part here across your knuckles, pointing towards where my weapon is when you hit it. Like that. Good. So, let's try that. Extend the arm. Extend your arm only, and then step. If you can, there. I'm afraid you're not quite set for lunging with this. Yes, because I'm like, I can make it shorter. <laughs> all right, are we ready? <laughs> Extra show. So, extend. Extend the arm. And lunge. Yes, now, the lunge is done with just the front foot. Oh, watch out, mister. See, now I'm learning. I like this. It's much easier to break the heart of the man. <laughs> Puncture. Puncture. Okay, one, two, three. Extend and lunge. Yes, and yeah. good, you have the right rotation. Like weapons, does so, um, oh, it's really heavy. It is, it gets wearing, oh. doesn't it? Are, are you a little more? Is this good? Yes, a little bit more. All right, let's teach you how not to get stabbed by someone doing what you just did. All right. So, if you're coming in, trying to strike me with this weapon, and I'm on nice. the all I do good. is interpose my weapon, yeah, such that if you extend, I miss good. Yeah, you by so, a good distance. Yeah. So, how far do I have to move it? Not very. Okay. Just a little bit. So, if I'm attacking you here. Ooh, I'm close. Across. That no, 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 not, not that far. Not that far. Bring it back. There. So, that's all you need. And I miss by... Inch. Inch. Significantly more. 
ideally, you would parry only enough so that I just barely miss. Because the further you move off the center, the uh, slower your repost will be, the slower your, your attack after it will be. So, come on guard, good. And I will attack you. So you up here, arms only, and then, so you're standing here, with attack comes in, block it. Just, just your arms. Okay. Good. So you just the, no, no, that's your foot. Just move. Hold the foot still. Ah, arms, good, good. Now, so don't pull back. Just block. Now, you extend your arm. And hit. Oh, my oh, nice. Maintaining the contact on the blade. All right. So come on guard. Stand, stand on guard. It's about two foot apart. Uh, right foot forward. Right foot forward. Yes. No, no, no. I'm attacking you. So I, I do all the, I do all the discipline. So everybody will be fighting to attack you. I attack, you block, and then you extend your arm. Yes. And bring it in. Oh, good. I'm good. I'm getting better. All right. Try one more time. Circle right. There's no circle. By, by moving your weapon into one line, you say, attack me on the other side. Okay. So you've invited me to attack, so I do. You block, and then extend, and strike. Good. So that's the basic defensive action that you do. Now, um, a lot of this, yes, no, it's, it's comfortable to have uh, for a long time. Uh, additionally, that, that was defense, offense, right? Two motions. I defend myself, and then I attack. We frequently, with this weapon, do both at once. So, you know, if you were coming in here, I would frequently simply strike. And in hitting, move your weapon off to the side so that I don't get the so We call that a counterattack, an attack into an attack. And we don't tend to do that for demonstrations uh, in, in our intro lessons because the timing is too good. Uh, we're going to one more action. Uh, one more action. One more action. All right. So, what do we do? Yes. Okay. We can try maybe like uh, like they do in the movies, like boom, boom, boom. But I teach real sword fighting. <laughs> All right. So your weapon is in the middle, or even a little bit on the inside. And I if I attack you on this side, how do you defend yourself? On first, there. Or the back. Yes. So you're going to do that. Once you've done that, okay. this is the fun part. So you've, you've defended yourself. Now you're going to pass forward with your foot, pivoting around, pass forward. So step forward with it, all the way forward towards me, reaching with your off hand. You're going to just grab my wrist from me. Yeah, just look like that. No, 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 don't move like that. I mean, ideally, what this looks like is. Because when I told this have swords, but 
The better dressed you are, the more likely you are to defend yourself. Oh, yes, I agree with you. But thank you so much. You're very welcome. Glad you could join us. Would you like to take a picture somewhere? We can pose for you. I gave you a card. Alright, so first let's talk about guards. My lords and ladies, so Jason has mace in hand! It's all the still with sword! something in the helmet for the horses. A one, a five, a fifty. The horses don't care because it all turns into hay and they eat it right up and then they poop it right out. <laughs> My lords, it... it's okay if we do. Horse, horse hockey is just like holy water, it'll heal you. Now, my lords and ladies, please remember that. Also, all of the things go over that are at the, at the relic booth, they are all go directly to the horses. Mount your horse, sir. My lords and ladies, give Sir Thomas a hand as he mounts his horse in victory. Sir, ride this ridder in victory. My lords and ladies, as you are putting your hands together, please keep it going for our hardworking squires. Our ladies in the back, and of course, Lady Andrea, and Rainy, and the Lady Ophelia Bottomwiggle. Give it up. For the Blue Knight, Sir Jason! <laughs> my lords and ladies, my name 
is Sarita's Black Heart, and together and collectively, we are the Imperial Knights. My lords and ladies, thank you all for coming. Now, wait before you go. How many of you would like to ride one of these magnificent steeds? You may do so. We shall start the, the line for that right down here. By right the here. We ask a five dollar donation. If you wish to have your picture taken while you are doing it, you may work that out with the photographer as well. We have a professional photographer here. We will also give you a refrigerator and take home with you. My lords and ladies, we all thank you for coming. We shall see you on the morrow.